A popular tourist destination in both summer and winter, Mont Tremblant's panoramic gondolas are a draw for many. Today, though, a terrifying tragedy. One person is dead, another in critical condition. Emergency services were dispatched here uh, concerning a collision between a vehicle and a gondola. It was a construction vehicle and at the force of the impact, two persons were projected outside of the gondola. Depending on where the gondola was, they could have fallen anywhere from 10 to 40 meters. But what is clear is that they hit the ground very hard. Every day, hundreds to thousands of people come to take in the sights. This weekend was especially popular because Mont Tremblant was hosting the International Blues Festival. The gondolas carry visitors to the top with breathtaking views on the way. What's unclear is how this collision could even happen. Police say it took place about halfway between the base of the mountain and the summit. Almost immediately, the gondolas were evacuated. Provincial police also cut off access to the mountain. At the base, crowds quickly thinned out. A spokesperson for the resort said nothing like this has ever happened before. We offer sympathies to the family. It's a very difficult day for us because it's such a hard ship and a hard day. We canceled the blues festival that was happening on the mountain today. And we also closed our activities by respect to the family. So, Sarah, this evening, still not a lot of basic information of, of what happened. And, Ian, lots of people stopping me tonight asking me just how on earth this could happen. So far, uh, Mont Tremblant officials and the police are not saying a lot. They won't say what construction was ongoing or what vehicle uh, hit the gondola. There's also a question of just how two people were able to be ejected from the gondola. Uh, before departure, the doors are, are checked to make sure that they're locked and the windows themselves don't open. Police, though, they say all those questions should be answered as this investigation continues. And I know you'll stay on the story. Sarah Levitt in Mont-Tremblant, Quebec.